The Florida Current, an online news service smartly covering politics and policy. Subscribe for free daily alerts at thefloridacurrent.com. From one end of Florida to the other, the threat of sinkholes is imminent. We're going to have more sinkholes. That's just a, a, a result of living here in Florida. Florida geologists say the rainy summer is speeding up the process of underground limestone collapse, creating the potential for more sinkholes to form. Several have formed in heavily populated areas, like this one near Disney World earlier this month. You see the steam? Yeah. See it opening? As common as sinkholes are, geologists say man has helped speed up the process. Certain times of the year or certain events can trigger sinkhole activity. Officials say that sinkholes along man-made ponds like here in East Tallahassee are quite common. The Tallahassee sinkhole opened up last week. Although unlikely to cause any damage to nearby houses, people in the area say they will still keep a close eye on the hole. It doesn't worry me too bad. It worries me a little bit about the people's house that's close to it. With more people moving to Florida, geologists say the number of sinkhole reports will undoubtedly go up, creating a possible recipe for disaster. Unfortunately, as a geologist, it's, uh, it, it, we can't predict exactly when and where a sinkhole will occur. Sinkholes are most common from central Florida through the Big Bend in north Florida because the limestone base is older than in other parts of the state. In Tallahassee, I'm Matt Horn reporting.